I want to preface this by you probably hearing some loud sirens behind me and uh, we do believe that possibly the car, the squad car is malfunctioning right now because the scene has been cleared for the most part. So this is not a dangerous area anymore. Take a look at some video. Let's talk about what happened. So earlier tonight, the Jefferson between nine and 10 closed for a long portion of time because of this police chase that you were talking about. Believed to started in Gross Point Shores and then ending here in St. Clair Shores where they were in hot pursuit of a suspect where they eventually were able to get him into custody at this location. A large part of Jefferson blocked off because of course they were trying to get this man out of the car. There was a chopper above. Now as far as we know no one was hurt but we do have preliminary reports that were there were shots fired. Whether or not that was coming from the police or coming from the suspect that is unclear right now. Unfortunately, we, we were actually hoping to get an update from police, but they all saw us here on the corner, but they decided that they were not going to give us any updates at this time, of course, leaving. And I do want to correct myself. That squad car that you heard in the background of the live shot at the beginning, he did leave uh, with lights and sirens. So at first we thought maybe it was malfunctioning because the scene's cleared, but now it appears that he may have actually just been getting everything ready to go to another scene because he did just take off that way. We're unsure if that was related to this, but of course, we're going to stay on top of it, bringing you the latest as soon as we get it. For now, we're live in St. Clair Shores. Camille Mary, Fox 2 News.